Hey, it's Danny from Cog Global, and I'm here with the awesome Rita Jones, <laughs> and you. we've got a guest in the shop today, and a little bit overwhelmed by this, because I, I kind of didn't know that this was going to happen, but apparently there's been, um, this guy, I don't know if you, you can see this guy, this is Fred, Fred the Fisher, am I, am I right? <laughs> That's what he says in his book, and Fred is somebody that Rita has actually made, and made for a specific purpose made for Cork Global. He's got the Cork Global hat on. He's got the jacket on. And if you guys can see this, I'll show you on show you on the back. Turn him round in, in his little mystery bucket that he's, he's arrived in. You see, he's got the Cork Global jacket on and a bunch of stuff. Tell me and tell the guys watching this video, Rita. Why am I now holding a, a doll called Fred we, with like fishing rods? And we were talking stuff. online about mascots. And I actually said to a few of the other anglers in Cork Global, um, what do you think about me dressing this doll up? And then one thing led to another, and they decided that they would call, <laughs> they would call the doll Fred, and he would go to all the anglers that they could get him to, and then end up in the shop. Well, Fred's been on his journey, and he's been to Texas, He's been to the Isle of Wight and he's been fishing with quite a few of the guys from Carp Global and he's got a little log book with him. Well, tell, all, tell us about the log book. He's got a little log book with messages for Danny and Shiv and if anybody wants to come in the shop and have a selfie with him, um, give a little bit to charity for your selfie and sign the book. Well, this is, well, we've had a lot of stuff made and done for us and, and we can't thank people enough for all that stuff but this is probably the most awesome of all the things we've had done for us and you can see he's got his little book and he's got a log and he's actually got like dare tickets in here so where he's been where he's been fishing it's like fisheries and stuff so i think fred's been fishing more times he's, this year than he's i have been to texas he's, he's actually been to texas and, and like a lot of people who live in the uk don't get chance to go to america i've been fortunate to go to america quite a few times um but fred's been He's been fishing with Tommy Kerbo. <laughs> He's been fishing with Tommy Kerbo. So Tommy, and I know there's a bunch of names in, in, in this book. I know Tommy, and I know Deb Leishman, and I know even Sean Hastings is in here. Uh, Scott Dobson's in here. There's just too many names to mention. Loads of you guys have, have had this um, opportunity. And and we've got lots of photos to post later, Danny. <laughs> so, so Rita's going to send me the photos. We're going to put them up in the group. And we recorded this video with Rita and Fred just now, just... Firstly, to say thanks uh, to Rita and for sort of doing this in the first place, for having that inspiration. So what, where did you get this idea? Obviously, just talking in the group, but clearly you don't just say, now I'm going to make a doll. So you must have been doing no, this for a, I, a while. I've made dolls for quite a number of years. Yeah. And Fred was actually made seven years ago and sat waiting for someone and I wouldn't let him go. I wouldn't sell him. I couldn't sell him. I don't know why. But the answers clearly come. Um, if you notice, Fred's got a little bit of ginger hair showing, <laughs> <laughs> but he hasn't got a beard. It, it, it'll take time for it. He just made the ideal doll um, to come to Cork Global. So that's how Fred come about. <laughs> so if you were to sell him, well, how much do you like? You've met him for seven years, and you might yeah, have sold the odd I've one. I've sold my dolls for hundred to hundred and fifty pounds all around the world. So there's, there's you know. Not only a lot of effort and a lot of messages and sneaking around and all sorts yeah. of stuff to try and get this. Like, I did not know about this when we've been here a year. Yeah. And clearly Fred's been traveling. He's been going round. Yeah. When, when, when did he start his journey? When was the oh, first? I the, think the first he entry? started at Haber, was it Haber Home Lakes, his first fishing point. Yeah, that So I think the date yeah. should be on the ticket. So the date's on the ticket, guys. Um, da -da 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 -da. Where well, we're looking, 11th, 11th of January, right? Yeah. 11th of January he started. So he's, he's almost been fishing for Carp Global for a, for a year. A, for a year. <laughs> and I guess that, that's testament to your commitment as well, Rita, to Carp Global. And, and, and the other members and, uh, who've <laughs> insisted on, they wanted Fred. Uh, some were unfortunate and they didn't get to get him, but they can always come in the shop. Yeah, and Fred's here. No doubt. <laughs> Um, this is not the end of Freddie. He is going to take the, the pride of place on the shelf, but I am thinking maybe some other guys could yeah. get him and he could go <laughs> fishing. And like, we, we, if you want to do that and you're part of the Avengers, then you know, let us know and we, 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 can, we can sort that out. But I think there was a point, Rita, where he was a little bit worried about 
how we would receive Fred. Yeah, I had um, one of the haters emails and um, decided to tell me that Danny knew all about Fred. He didn't like Fred, he didn't want Fred. He, want, he was going to pay somebody to get rid of him on the way. Well, that's not like just un <laughs> untrue and rubbish. And anything at Cart Global that people do for us, you know, we're always overwhelmed, and we always, you know, we always want to give back, and we do a lot. Of, we do a lot of giving, and it's not, you know, every day that somebody goes to this extent of putting things together. And look, Tommy's been putting gifts in. There's, there's the oh, fishing yeah, he's rod. Got in. T-shirts and all sorts in the bucket. It, he's got his own fishing rod. He comes in. He comes in a mission. This is actually a real rod. It's like I could, you'd probably catch something on this. So Fred comes fully equipped with his log, his rod. He's got little gifts that people have sent. And I know Tommy sent some other stuff from America. He is quite um, a legend in his own right. Yeah. And equally, I think uh, Rita is a legend in, in, in her own right. And we always want to try and give back to people who give to us. And you were fishing with us recently, right? Yeah, at Oxley's. Uh, at Oxley's and one of the um things you had a problem with your bivy right yeah <laughs> tell, tell us about your bivy we got to oxley's um lucky um scott dobson decided to help us he's one of the guys who's had the, yeah. the dollars uh, he came round and he says i'll help you put the bivy up um to me and ian we got the bivy all out to find out that the two extension <laughs> bits are missing and bits board. bars on the top of the bivy were missing luckily Ian chopped a bit of a tree <laughs> and made do with a few sticks just to last us a weekend. So, so what, where's Ian? Ian, come Ian, here. Ian, come here. So Ian is the, the man that supports. Uh, they, they always say, well, behind every good man there's a good woman and behind every good woman there's a good man, yeah, right? He, he holds me up, he's my rock. So you guys are, are awesome and really want to say a big thank you for, for doing this, but... I kind of had an idea, just talking about the bivy and whatnot. I did try and look for some poles, but I couldn't, yeah. I couldn't find poles to, to just give you some poles. Because you've done quite a lot of stuff and this is like super cool and amazing, I thought we could do some, something super cool and amazing for you guys, right? So we've had a look round upstairs and we're actually just going to give you a bivy. Oh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and, we're, and we're not just going to give you any bivy, we're just going to like give you the probably the best bivy we can find. So, oh, bless you. dragging it out for you now. So, you guys oh, have just like you. come up with this super cool thing and you've sent it all around the world. And I think it's super awesome. And but oh, no, at no time ever did I ever say I want to burn this or do anything. And we've got to thank people like Lee and, and, and Scott and all the guys who've had this. And we're going to do some stuff, we're going to make an example of it in a live. She's just checking down there. We've managed to find one of, well, basically, we've got a Rod at Chinson too, man. Oh, Maybe brilliant. Worth oh, 600 sure. quid. Oh, and it's yours. Lord, and you can have you it. And sure. come fishing, I wish you were totally sure. This, to me, is worth the same Thank or more. You. Yeah. You, and, you oh, don't <laughs> <laughs> um, We can do it because we can. And. I had a chat to Shiv just before and thought, how are, we going to, how are we going to give these guys something back? And if somebody goes to that extent Thank of you. creating something and doing something and keeping it going and despite people sending nasty things, oh crap, and all this kind of horrible stuff to try and stop it, we recognise that and we recognise that as something that means so much to us that we want to give you guys something Thank back. You. So Shiv's dragged this, this bivy out somewhere. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. It, 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 weighs, it weighs a little bit more than Fred does, but you guys, you're more than welcome to oh, take that home you. in the car. Uh, next, time, uh, next time you come fishing with us or go fishing yeah. on your own, everything's in there. Pegs, poles, the lights, it's full, full two man bivy. It's worth, it's worth about 600 quid. Oh, and God. From us, uh, from the guys at Rod Hutchinson who help us to be able to do some of these prizes and stuff as well, you're more than welcome. And we Thank love Fred, you. and he's going to feature in a big bunch of videos. Thank and you. And you guys, if you want to do anything for, awesome for us as well, please feel free. But we'll carry on doing awesome stuff for you as well. It's Danny, it's Fred, and Rita, and Ian, live from Cock Global in Preston. Thanks so much Thank for watching, guys. Buddy. See you on the next video. Bye bye.